today's video we're going to be talking about the difference between moissanite and diamonds a quick disclaimer everyone has their own preferences but today's video is basically just to address the most common question that we get what is the difference between moissanite and diamonds so depending on the situation we always try to recommend moissanite over diamonds obviously depending on the circumstances and the budget and what the client is actually looking for and as long as the client understands the difference, we then negotiate from there, but this is why we usually recommend moissanite over the diamonds. Moissanites are naturally occurring gems made of silicon carbide. It's a rare mineral that was discovered by a French chemist named Henri Moissan in the 1800s. The gem was first discovered in the crater created by a meteorite that fell to Earth. However, in today's world, it is lab created. So there are four key differences that we'll be discussing today. The first one is pricing. So moissanites are generally more affordable. I wouldn't say cheaper, I would say more affordable than diamonds. So diamonds for a lower quality, smaller stone, you're going to be paying more than more for it than a higher quality, larger moissanite. So that's just how expensive diamonds are and obviously to each their own but if you're looking for a bigger stone or a relatively okay size stone then and you have a smaller budget than 150,000 or 200,000 then then moissanite is definitely the best option. One carat moissanite is about one tenth of the price for one carat diamond. So just to put in perspective that is how big the range is between a moissanite glass and a diamond glass. So the second thing we're going to be talking about is durability. So it's a known fact that diamonds are the most durable stones. They can withstand anything and that's what kind of adds more to the value and to the cost of a diamond. But a diamond scores 10 out of 10 for its hardness, whereas a moissanite is a 9.5 out of 10, which is still really negative, which means that it is a durable stone, but it is more affordable. So the third difference we're going to talk about is brilliance. So brilliance refers to like the sparkle of a stone. Moissanites have more brilliance than a diamond because they are refractive, they are cut differently than a diamond, which means that it enhances the sparkle, the brilliance of the stone. So if you are in the sunlight or under a flash and you move it, it's going to reflect more than you would if, if it was a diamond. So it, you reflect it if you, well, the best way to do it is under the sun. So if you're standing in the sunlight and you do this, it will reflect a rainbow, whereas a diamond reflects pure white. So that's also the difference between the moissanite and the diamond in terms of brilliance. Bringing us to the fourth key difference is color. So just like diamonds, moissanite also come in colorless to nearly colorless and then also colors. So the first thing is that you get the color D, which is the in moissanite, the color D is colorless, completely colorless, and it's also the more the most expensive type of moissanite. So moissanites naturally occur in like a slightly yellow tone, but the industry has perfected the processing of making these moissanites completely white, which is also what adds to the value and why it's a little bit more expensive than say the G color moissanite. So G H and I is nearly colorless it kind of has like a yellow tint to it it is the cheaper version because it hasn't undergone the process of making it completely colorless and white so the difference here is that diamond has a more variety of colors so it ranges from d to z with z being like yellow brown so that's the difference between the, the moisture and diamonds in terms of color so just an overall thought or conclusion to the video um i generally refer or recommend moissanite as opposed to diamonds most because there aren't a lot of people that have the budget for diamonds or like a little one not even a one carat 0.5 carat can cost you 
same as if you are in your first love looking on the diamond and sure okay this is the next video um it doesn't do that great diamonds or natural diamonds i always recommend moissanite because people don't want a small little stone but also don't have the budget to be paying like 200 thousand for a few carats so generally that's what i do first if they are leaning more towards diamonds obviously then i open that for them as well like you don't often choose that but i think that the moissanite is it just makes a lot more sense when you're getting a bigger stone it looks exactly the same as a diamond in terms of moissanite you're getting a bigger stone for a lot less money like one tenth of the price so it, for me i just let them choose that option first if they are insistent on a diamond i offer the diamond to them but um they usually most of my clients prefer the moissanite like i said in the beginning of the video to each their own um everyone has a preference and everyone has different beliefs about the industry so we i allow them to make that decision also based on what they know and what they want or what they're looking for in terms of stuff so we've come to the end of the video uh, please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe you can comment any questions that you have if i maybe missed something you can comment and i'll definitely answer your question um for any quotes or queries for engaging things you can feel free to WhatsApp us, uh, email us, DM us, Facebook inbox, a comment on the TikTok video, comment on the video below and we'll give you a quote within 24 to 48 hours depending on what you're looking for if you know what you're looking for. Also if you aren't really sure on what you want and just want to see a catalogue I will link the online website down below in the description where you can check out the catalogue of things that we already have to offer. So you can follow us on all of our social media and Turn on your post notifications for our YouTube channel so that you are notified when we post. So the idea behind the YouTube channel is to bring more education about stones, the different metals that you can choose from for your ring, um, what to look for when you're looking for an engagement ring, all of those type of things. And then also I'm hoping to do some entrepreneurial advice as well because I do get a lot of questions about that. Yeah, uh, so follow us on all our socials to be notified when we have another video coming up. I usually post snippets of the video, just kind of like teasers and reminders so that you do know when we will be posting and so that you don't miss a video. So thanks guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video.